this is Tim from Tim's Tiny Arcade, where today we're going to look at the Atari Flashback Portable, where it has 70 built-in games. This is the 40th anniversary. This one has an SD card slot and a 2.8 LCD display. And some of the games that are already preloaded on it, we have Activision games this year, where we have Pitfall, River Raid, Kaboom, Frogger, which is not actually the Parker Brothers version, and Pac-Man, which is actually a homebrew. Uh, Dig Dug, Galaxian, and let's look at the back here real quick. It's some more games they have on there. Quick look at these. And like I said, SD slot, you can add your own games, which I have done and we can look at here in a second. All right, here's the system itself with the instruction book that it comes with. Um, right here up on top, you have a reset button, a start button, you have some of uh, the difficulty and select buttons there. Your control pad. This one actually has a pause button. And right here you have the red button, which would be like your action button for the game. And on top here, you have where you would plug it in to charge it. Headphone jack. Um, right here is the SD slot, which I have a card in already. And a volume, so you can adjust the volume on it. All right, so we're going to power this on. We'll look at the games that are kind of on it. Go through that real quick. There's your screen that comes on when you initially turn it on. It's very similar to the other Atari flashbacks. The Pac-Man, even though that shows that Pac-Man, the actual Pac-Man you will get is Pac-Man 4K. You just hit the reset button and it'll take you back. And then you go to the SD slot, which I got my games from Atari Age. And I got 67 pages and there's 10 games on each page. So you got quite a few games here. It takes a second to load. And then you can see there is tons of games. You could probably get the complete library of all games made for the Atari. So let's look at uh, Beam Rider. This is one of the games on the SD card. As you can see, it looks just like the original. And it sounds just like the original. Kind of hard playing one-handed. All right, and uh, well, let me stop it here and we'll try another one. All right, the last game we're gonna look at, we're gonna look at Ms. Pac-Man. Start it up here, and this is, like a, is another one that's on the SD uh, card. And as you can see, it looks, sounds, and plays just like that. So my final thoughts on the Atari Flashback Portable if you're an Atari fan, I think it's a must to get to, for your collection. Uh, definitely because you've got the SD card slot where you can add all these games. And you can get deals on these. I ended up paying around 30 bucks for these. I think normally they're $49.99. So I think if you look around, you probably could find a deal on one of these. Um, they actually even have a two, 2016 model. Like I said before, this is the 2017 model. And the only thing really different on it is the control pads a little bit different I believe and uh, anyway if you like the video give it a like and until next time we'll see you later